Howdy, y'all. My name is Price. We're coming at you once again with another episode of something brand new. This game is Oculus, and this is actually an early alpha version of this game. You can't really get it right now, but uh, I was fortunate enough that uh, my good friend Pablo actually has worked with this developer in the past, and uh, while he hasn't worked on this game in particular, uh, he was able to talk to these devs and uh, get us a copy of this game to play, and I'm super excited too, but I just thought I would let you guys know that up front, that yes, I know someone who has worked with these people people in the past. Anyways, this game has a great pixel art style, and I kind of think of it as, uh, it's very, it reminds me of Pikmin. I've only played a very little bit of it, but it reminds me a little bit of Pikmin in that kind of where you control a large group of characters. In this one, it takes place in kind of ancient Greece, and you're going around trying to create a giant mob. And um, with that in mind, let's just go ahead and jump in. You'll see a little bit of the story. We'll go through the tutorial uh, level, and then we will jump into the game. So here we go. As the titans before them, the mighty Olympian gods kept mankind prey of their whims and utter disregard of common politeness. Until... Huh? Oh no! It's very Monty Python-esque. <laughs> you son of a bitch. Revengeance! It's an ancient Greek word, revengeance. Alright. Hi there, I'm aboard. All right, so this level is kind of like a quick little tutorial level. We learn to run. We learn... Can I get you? Yeah, I can. We learn how to get people, which is by bumping into them. All right, so now as you can see, we're getting people. We have this little cursor over here uh, where we can move our mob around. You see, we've got cats and dogs and all kinds of things. We've got a pig, which is the best, obviously. Best character ever. Uh, so we can move them around. If we use the right trigger, we can um, tell them to attack whatever they're near. So you'll see they'll attack those boxes. And as I start sending them in this direction, they'll also start to attack this wall of boxes so that we can get through here. Let's go, suckers. Come on. Get our way through. Come on. All right. Our pigs and chickens and whatnot got through. The rest of us need to make a little space. Okay. We can um, press LB to disperse. So it kind of spreads our guys out, which is actually really useful for um, quickly um, getting all of the other characters in an area. Um, and it also has other value in it as well which uh, I learned the hard way, we'll say. Um, okay, so here we see some poisonous uh, meats that we're obviously going to want to avoid as best we can. Oh, okay, so let's get everybody down here, come on. Oh, that chicken ate some of the meat. So what you wanna do when you've eaten poison is you want to actually spread out um, because, the, oh God, you ate some too, huh? Um, because it can spread throughout your mob if you're not careful. So we're gonna send them all down this way as much as we can to avoid things. You can see we have a little mini-map in the lower right that helps us um, with a lot of stuff. All right, we pick up more guys. Okay. And uh, if we go over, oh god. All right, so if you hold, oh, I pressed the wrong button, that's why. If you hold left trigger, you can defend. And then when stuff comes down to hit you or whatever, you can actually block attacks from enemies. Uh, and so that's something that we'll definitely want to be doing. All right, let's kill this guy. Huzzah. Left trigger. Oh, block. Block. Yeah, so we're able to block some of those, you can see. Not all of them. Uh, but uh, definitely useful for certain attacks later on. There's lots of stuff that can be very dangerous. Okay. Uh, oh, we got one of those. So now we have a special item. And so if you look in the lower left, we have kind of a D-pad uh, looking thing. And if we use that, it will do a special attack. So let's use that. Kaboom! We blew him up. Which I'm sure also probably blew up our guys, although it doesn't look like it actually hurt us very much. Alright, so we're breaking stuff. Now we're heading to Delphi. Or Delphi. I don't really know too well how to pronounce Greek words. It's fine. Delphi, probably. All right. So we want to avoid that thing, or at least avoid blowing it up. Oh, come on, guys. Come on. Come down here. Okay. So first and foremost, let's look around for other guys to add to our mob. Hello. Yeah, because the more the merrier, am I right? I love the art style. I mean, this is like this kind of... 3D plane that you move along. It's very crisp um, in the way that it runs. And, uh, oh, okay, here we got a big guy. Maybe we can take him on. Oh, hey, dick. Guess what? Block. Yeah, block that, you son of a jerk. Got him. Cool. And as we kill more guys, we'll also gain more followers from all the people around, so that's nice. Hey, leave those people alone, jerk. See, these people are all just so mean. We can actually, like, destroy... Oh my god, there's, like, a Cthulhu fountain. What does that have to do with, uh, ancient Greece? Can we break it? 
No, we can't break it. I was wondering if maybe we could like summon Cthulhu. That'd be pretty great. And some, you'll see that the AI of the different bad guys uh, operates in uh, unique fashion. So some of them will actually run away from you, which uh, is fine. Uh, that actually can be useful to kind of push them into certain directions. Come on, red guy. I want to draw him out here. That um, poison barrel over there. If I attack and one of my, if I'm attacking and one of my guys is near that, he'll blow it up, which is something I definitely don't want. All right, get him. Yeah. So it really is all about you want to like overwhelm your enemy. It looks like that guy accidentally blew that up for me. So thank you, sir. And let's just get everybody over here. Yeah, run away, suckers. All right, let's eat the rest of these. I say eat. It's because I'm thinking Pikmin. Let's crush them. Oh, whoa, we picked up a thing. Oh, cool, 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 cool. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So that's like a power up, and I think it'll boost our attack temporarily when we use it. So if we come across a, a big guy or like this kind of like a mob of guys, it's usually a good place to do it. But I think we're fine. Okay, let's uh, let's stay down. We want to avoid that poison to the best of our ability. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Okay, we got some meat. That's nice. I'm not sure what meat does. Maybe it heals our guys. Probably heals our guys. All right, so we busted this place up. You can break um, lots of places, which will also often reveal items and things. So let's sneak around this way and try and avoid again any kind of uh, dangerous stuff. Yeah, uh, we're gonna have to blow this up. I think. Let's get them. Come on. Yeah, run away. Run away. Haha. -ha. All right, screw it. We'll take it. I can handle it. All right, we'll use a, uh, a healer thing in a little bit. Eh. Yeah, run him away. Run for the hills. Ha. Remember, I can run too. I always forget that. All right. Ha! Crush him. All right, we'll use the meat. Let's see. Did he heal us? Yeah. Very cool. Very cool. Didn't realize that, but uh, oh, and we have an extra one too. And uh, we'll see that there's another value to those kinds of things in a little bit as well. All right, here we go. Hiya! Got him. Cool. All right, everybody, let's go this way. And I've found so one thing that is a little tricky is sometimes your guys seem to have trouble like getting back up to you. Right now they're doing pretty fine, but uh, sometimes if you look on the lower mini map, you'll see you'll have some guys that are kind of like stuck way out on the other side of the level. And if you use the disperse, that seems to help a lot. Okay, so here we can spend some of our mob in order to get power-ups or special people into our mob. So you see we can get um, Orpheos. Nearby units get attack plus 40, defense plus 40, morale plus 40, but it's gonna cost us 15 of our regular um, people. And then here we can get Theseus, who will give us attack plus 10, but it's gonna cost us five of our warrior people. And if you look down in the lower left, you can see all of our counts right now. I'm thinking that one of the best moves we could go for now, what do we got? We got 38 of 50. I think higher attack defense morale from Orpheus could be really good. Um, yeah, I think we're going to go for that. And now our mob is too small for us to gain anything else other than I don't want to waste our warriors to get the uh, Theseus bonus yet. But uh, yeah, so I think we'll, yeah, well, from here we'll move forward. All right, let's kill this guy. I think those guys can die, so you have to be careful. All right. Okay. Break everything that we can. Come on, y'all. Yeah. Do, 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 do. Oh man, I love the style of this. It really is just fantastic. I'm trying to crush everything I can. All right. Come on. Come on. Got him. Let's kill this guy. Come on. Yeah. All right. This is another power up thing. That's a defensive one, so that'll be really useful at one point. Oh, you know what? I think now might be that time. Let's go, y'all. Yeah, crush the enemy. Crush the enemy. Crush the enemy! Usually you want to try and separate guys, I think. We're, in a, we're a mega chaotic mob now. I'm pretty sure what you want to do is, yeah, you want to separate guys from their group just because um, they're easier to kill when they are alone. Can we break any of these houses? Yeah, we can break some of these. Break everything. Always break everything. That's my motto. In any game that's got destruction, you destruct. You destroy all the things. Oh yeah. So yeah, um, another thing that we will, what you'll have noticed now that we are in Delphi 1-2 is that the levels are kind of um, big. You don't just, you know, have one stage that you clear. You have several points within a stage that you go through um, before completing the level. All right, come on, y'all. Let's get over here. <sighs> break all the buildings. Also, breaking all the buildings usually helps you to have, like, a little more space. Woo! Careful there. Hey, 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 don't be a jerk. Yeah, gotcha. All right. All right, let's get everybody up by uh, Orpheus or whatever his name is. Give us our little boosts. Where am I? Oh, I'm slow. Oh, it's because of that dirt. Gotcha. All right, these like uh, there's like these um, glow or, or what are they? Misty kind of things on the ground there. It's like the uh, 
stuff that the Oracle would use in order to have her visions, which you know now we know is hallucinations based off of gas that would uh, pour up into the um, temple from down below. Strange thing when you build atop a, mount, or, uh, atop a uh, volcano. <laughs> uh, or uh, a heat vent, rather. Anyway, so uh, let's crush all these things. we got some guys down here. I saw some poison meat that I'm trying to avoid. So I'm just trying to look around. Yeah, here we go. Yeah. Whoa, went a little fast there. It's a little, little wobbly there. All right, let's get all these guys. Okay, and come on, get him. Oh, no. Oh, no. We accidentally ate some meat. Spread out. Spread out. Hurry, buddy. All right. Where is he? Ugh, right next to the poison meat. Come on, jerk. Oh, there's a guy down there. Oh, someone ate it. You ate it. Why'd you eat it? All right, spread out. And don't spread the disease. That guy's a jerk. Ah, get him. Nice. Okay, cool. And then it looks like our exit is this way. Oh, look, another meat thing. Cool. And our mob is almost back up to full size, so I'm glad we spent what, uh, what of our mob that we did. Can we get a guy that heals? That would be really nice to have, I think. Mob capacity, attack. So this guy at the top would be nice, but we haven't gotten enough of the blue soldiers. Uh, so I guess those are like Greek soldiers rather than Spartans. Uh, we could get Theseus, who gives everybody an attack plus 10. Could also get mob capacity up, which might be smart. Do we want King Radamanthus or King Minos? I think, let's go with King Minos. Oh, look, there's philosophers too that you can get. That's awesome. Uh, I'll go King Minos for now. Uh, and we're at 31. I think we could, yeah, we can lose five Spartans to get a 10% bonus to everybody. I think that's a good idea. All right, cool. I would really love to get that healer, but that's fine. We'll get one eventually. No, don't eat it. Don't eat it. These philosophers, I think we've got some philosophers. Nice. Cool. All right, let's kill all these guys. Jerks. Mega chaotic mob. Let's go. Ha! Kill him, kill him, kill him, kill him before he can do anything. Nice. Come on, get him. Get him. All right. Oh, did I die? I might have. I got hurt. And, and I think if your character gets hurt or dies, then you turn into just another person in the mob. I think. I'm not positive. But every now and then I've seen that slow-mo thing happen. I don't know exactly what it's... Uh, in reference to, whoa, again, with a, a game that's in this early build, like a lot of the stuff, unless you um, have been keeping up with the game since it started, you know, sometimes it can be hard to uh, know what everything does. All right. But I will say that uh, it's a pretty intuitive game. I very quickly started to pick up on all of the components. Oh, man, we're, uh, we're not doing so hot on health. All right. All right, spread out, y'all. Let's, let's go ahead and eat one of our meat just to heal up a little bit. All right. Yeah, look at this. Get them all. Yeah. Nice. Come down. All right. Uh, what else we got? Uh, you got to rush these guys down for sure. That's the strategy on them. These guys, they seem to be pretty straightforward. Oh, those those uh, mage guys, you kind of just want to avoid. What's over there? Like, look, my guy who's dead over here. Wonder if I could fix him, and uh, if I had a healer, maybe. Kill him! Yeah, there we go. All right. Uh, yeah, take him out. Take him out. You just kind of like sweep your guys across the battlefield. It's pretty great. Uh, eh, eh. Get him! All right. Very cool. All right. Uh, and looks like we got two more guys down here. We'll crush a couple of these suckers. Get another. I think she's a philosopher, which would be great. Uh, let's kill him, hurry, and then spread out so that the disease doesn't get too spread. Let's heal again. All right. And we're down to 48. Not so bad. All right, come on. Come on, you jerk. I don't like those guys. They just run away. They make things annoying. They force you into parts of the level that you don't want to go into. All right. And let's see if we can't get anything else nice from the uh, this guy. Get another mob cap upgrade. We still don't have enough of those uh, yellow and blue warriors, the Greek warriors. It's too bad. I could go run back through there and see if maybe there's one more. Heals everyone a little in the mob every time an enemy is killed. That would be so useful. If you can get King Radamanthus. I'll go for it. Okay, uh, let's exit. Let me go back through here and just really quickly. Oh, can I not? Oh, yeah, I can. Okay, cool. I just want to very quickly see if there's anyone out here. Because, like, that doesn't that look like a piggy that we could join our group? Or is he dead? All right, let's crush all these things, maybe. Maybe there'll be somebody in a house. Oh, can't break that house. Can we break these? Yeah, we can break the stands. 
Okay, well, screw it. Let's go, y'all. Eh. All right, so now you can see, like, on the map, they're doing a pretty good job, the AI, of trying to get to where we are. I think if you kind of force them to, sometimes they will. All right. Oh, oh, dear. I didn't know that this was going to happen. Uh, defend! Got him. All right, cool. Kill this guy. Kill Apollo. Whoa, 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 where am I? Oh, I'm stuck. That can sometimes be difficult, is, like, you, you want to believe that you're a part of the mob. Let's, uh, let's use this defensive bonus. Oh, we should block. Ugh. Okay, and block! And block! And block! Get him, get him, get him, get him, get him, get him. Alright. Block! Uh, and I love that there are boss battles. This is awesome. My guy's getting hurt. Oh, God, I lost a couple. How did he do that? Got him! Take that, you jerk. Let's break his little tower things. Yeah! How do you like that? Huh? There probably was a better strategy. I think I lost like 10 guys there or something, so I should probably be a little more careful. But now we have made it to Sparta. And I think let's let's play a little bit more. I doubt we'll make it all the way to the next boss. Oh, God. Got a block there. But as you can see already, we're getting new types of... Oh, I think my character died. No? Yeah, yeah, yeah. And I became the lady. I think as long as you have philosophers, I think that means you have extra lives, essentially. Leave me alone. All right. Got some guys. Definitely use more, though. Oh, wow. That guy messed me up with the shield. Get him. Get him. Get him. Get him. Block. 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 Oh, no. You got me. Block. Got him. Okay. Just got to be careful about all that. All right. Let's get some guys. Another philosopher. Nice. All right. Let's do a spread out attack. Just tell everybody to go everywhere and crush everything. That might help. Our maximum size now is 95, which is awesome. I love that you can get so huge. All right, here comes another uh, Cyclops looking guy. Let's get him. Oh no, I got hit. Man, they, I think they charge right for you. The guys with the clubs, the Cyclopses with the clubs. Like they go right for the uh, the hero. Yeah, that's why I've been dying so much. My goodness, I didn't realize. It's all good though. Now I've learned. It's one of those kind of games. Learn. Oh goodness. What's this one doing? Okay. All right. All right. Now let's do another. We'll do another spread out attack. Crush all the things. Crush all the things. Do all the stuff. Break all the things so that you can find other power ups and then we can move on to killing stuff. Yeah. I really like this music. It's like, it's very fitting of the setting and also just very like, you know, uh, classic pixel art gamey kind of stuff, like NES, SNES style stuff. Not quite NES, obviously. Not it's not an 8-bit chip tune. Uh, okay, where are we at? 66 guys. That's pretty good. Please tell me I can get. Oh, and there's a whole new set of guys. Alexander the Great. Oh, how cool would that be? He's got a horse. Pandora. Props have a greater chance of dropping items, but they can also spawn enemies. Interesting. So it's a benefit and a cost. Uh, Maleager gives you attack plus 10%. That could be good. I want Hippocrates. Man, I want the healers. I ain't getting them, though. All right, let's 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 uh, let's clear another area. Maybe we can do this. Do, 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 do. Oh, there's fire. There's fire bad. Fire bad. Get away from it. Oh, gosh, guys. Oh, gosh. We're already in trouble. Whoa. Okay, okay. Get him. Get him. Don't let him hit me, because that's what he's coming for. Yeah. Yeah, we know your game, jerk. No, 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 no. Get him. Get him. Nice. Cool. All right. Yeah, see, now that I'm learning the different bad guys and their patterns and stuff, I'm doing a little bit better, I think. I think that's kind of part of the game is just learning it. Which is great. I love that in games where you have to kind of learn things about them uh, to get better at them. It's very, it's a very classic game style uh, component where, you know, a lot of modern games might not actually have that. You know, they're a little more like hold your handy, which is really useful in a lot of modern games because they can be so complex with uh, their crazy 3D-ness and their mechanics and whatnot. But at the same time, it can also be, um, I don't know, you lose a little bit of that sense of discovery. Okay, get him, get him, get him, get him. Nice, got him. All right. We're gonna take everybody down, mega chaotic mob. Oh, I love this. Oh, I love it. All right, get him. 
I love how when you have power-ups, you can see your guys carrying them around and all that. It's great. I might as well use one of these shields because we have so many of them. I doubt you can, like, you know, infinitely hold on to the power-ups. All right. Let's get him. All right, that guy's the one. Is he the one who throws rocks? The other big guy? Or no, he's just the one who stomps, I think. Yeah. Okay. Oh, God! Oh, spikes! Spikes! Everybody get down! Everybody get down! I didn't notice the spikes. Oh, that was bad. All right, everybody, come on. Okay, let's go. Uh, uh. Kill that big thing. Kill that big thing. He doesn't seem to be doing anything. He just seems to like walk through. Maybe he just stomps on you or something. Okay. Let's take out the rest of y'all. Oh no, no, don't run over the spikes. Oh, I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry to all of you. Oh my God. Oh my God, the spikes are terrible. There's spikes everywhere too. Who's this guy? Oh, he grew. Oh, that's bad. That's bad. What's he do? What's he do? Okay, I'm blocking as much as I can. Oh god, this is bad. This is bad. Eat some meat. Eat meat. Kill the guys. Let's try and get out of here as best we can. Let's go! Come on! Ugh. Draw him over this way. Oh, he died! Did we get him? Yes, I think he's dead. One of our guys is stuck in here. Let's break all these houses. This might help us to see a little bit better. I wonder if maybe this, like the type of mob that you have determines like what kind of stuff you can break. Because yeah, now we're breaking like the trees, like the, the like tree stands. That's crazy. We weren't able to do that earlier. So I think it must be like, so we're a mega chaotic mob, which makes us even more powerful, I think. Uh, one thing I would like is if uh, once you cleared an area, you know, because I, I get it before then. Um, once you cleared an area, if like other uh, characters that were in that area suddenly popped up on the minimap, like that would be kind of cool so that you could be like, oh, look, I missed a whole group of guys in the corner over here. Uh, all right. Well, you know what? Let's just go ahead and get this one just because we can. And I think this will probably be our last area. We might be able to make it to the second boss, which could be fun. All right. Take out these guys. Don't let them hit me. Protect me. I am your leader. I'm the leader of this mob. Run! Get him! Come on! Hit him! Hit him! Hit him! Hit him! Hit him! I don't want to get hit! Come on! Hit him! <laughs> All right, there we go. Okay, okay. What do we got now? Oh, big guy! Crap! Oh, but he shrank! Ha ha! You shranked! How do you like that? How do you like them apples? Block it! Block it! Block it! Yeah, got him. Okay, cool. All right, mega chaotic mob, bust down this house because you can. It'll help you, I promise. It does help, actually, really, to clear up the uh, the arena a little bit. All right. Nice. Take him out, take him out, take him out, take him out! Block! Block! That's the other thing, is, like, it looks... <laughs> the way that you can, like, counter and block is something that is so... Uh, different. Like, I wasn't expecting. Did the guy just pick that up? I think he did. I saw that. Oh, no. Oh, a, chi a chimera thing. It pounced down on us. There was a um, spear that was sitting here, and I think one of our guys, if I can look around, let's disperse a little bit. I think one of the warriors picked it up. Can't see. Uh, yeah, can't quite tell, but it looked like one of the warriors picked up one of those weapons, so that's cool if they did. I would like that. And, I'd, and it might not be the case that they did. It might be completely full of it, but it looked like it. All right, y'all. Let's, let's get them to come over to us. Why didn't that guy get hurt by the spikes? Come on. Yeah, there we go. Take him out. Do, 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 do. Can we pick this thing up? Should be able to, right? Somebody pick it up. We have too many power-ups. Let's use this one, then. Yeah, we did. Okay. Come on. Come on, jerk. Let's go. Do, 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 do. Mostly because I want to avoid the fire and the spikes and all that stuff. All right, let's go. Let's all push as close and tight against the wall as you can. And run! Cool. All right. Now rush up. Do, 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 do. Oh, can we not break this anymore? Oh, we lost our power. We lost our mega reckless mob stuff. Mega chaotic mob. So now we're no longer able to crush all the same stuff that we used to be. Is it because of our size? Is that why? Maybe we lost a couple guys. Can I pick this power up up? Nope, so we gotta use it. So I will use a healer. Pick up that one. Got it. No, nope. pick it up. We don't have enough guys to pick it up. Someone pick it up. Come on. Huh, that's weird. Don't know why I can't pick that up. All right, where are our bad guys? Come on, jerks, let's go. 
We're a cool mob now. We're losing our power, I think, because we haven't been fighting as uh, intensely. So let's change that, huh? Kill stuff! Oh, nice. We've got a whole bunch more guys in our party as well. Let's kill this guy. Come on. Did he just turn to gold? Or stone or something? All right. Where's, where are our next guys? All right. Just just deal with the fire. Just walk through the fire, okay? You there. Yeah, come on. Oh, he's one of these guys. Yeah. Go get him. I think you're all cool with your blocking. Come on, y'all. Let's get down here. Come on. Eh. These areas suck. It's bullshit. Bullshit. All right. Let's go, all y'all. Right, okay. Think. Think. Oh, God. Oh, man. See, like, this is one of those areas I'm talking about where, like, getting your guys all over here. It's like, look, they're all stuck in that corner, and they're not going to be able to get to me. I have to go babysit them out here. So this is a, like, again, there's should be some way of easily getting your mob. Come on, y'all. Through. Come on. I know you guys can fit through there. Several of you have already. Come on. I don't want to get the rest of them stuck, is the problem. Come on. There we go. Come on. Oh my god, they're a depressing mob now. Oh my god, this sucks. So we need our morale up. Sorry that I was... Oh, cool, we can get Hippocrates. That's nice. All right, let's see where we're at. So that's another thing that I wasn't aware of, was that mechanic. Oh, look, a Kratos! <laughs> that's awesome. All right, y'all. Bust shit up! Go crazy. All right, well, I don't think we're going to end up making it to the next boss, but I assumed, unless it's in this very next zone, I think we're going to have to uh, call it quits here in a second. I was hoping to show you a little bit more. I really am enjoying this game. I think it's a ton of fun. It's definitely something that you should keep your eye on if you uh, haven't been hearing too much about it already. Um, because uh, it's certainly, once it comes out, I think this will be something that a lot of people are really uh, going to enjoy. Just a nice, fun game. See you guys in a little bit, just because we got so many power-ups. Get out of here, you big jerks. You big, dumb jerks. Is there a way to increase morale? Like an item that does that? Because that would be nice. Bust these guys up. So that's an interesting mechanic too. Is like you got to be constantly busting stuff, otherwise your your characters are not very happy. Um, okay, let's go ahead and use one of those so that we can pick up another one. What happened there? Did that just raise guys from the dead? I'm confused with that. Anything you can break? Come on, join us, join us, y'all. All right, yeah, let's go this way. What's up in here? We want to be a crazy chaotic mob or whatever. All right, we got nothing new really in that area. So what's up in here? Is this the boss? Oh yeah, here we go. Okay, cool. I wanted to see what it is. It's that Leonidas. Got a couple of them. Got three crazy Spartans to kill. All right. Whoa. Whoa. Holy crap. What's going on here? All right, let's use all of our power-ups. Uh, boom. Oh, that didn't work. Is he dying or what? What's going on here? Can't tell. Ares. Okay. How are we doing on our mob size? I can barely tell when he's about to attack. He doesn't really give it away. Okay, cool. Got one. Kill this guy. Deimos. Oh, goodness. Deimos seems to attack me. Oh. Yeah, block that one, jerk. How do you like that? Phobos. Whoa! Phobos is a name that Ash uses a lot in his stuff. Oh, man. We're in trouble. Blow him up. Oh, my God, you guys. We're in trouble. Look at our mob. We have 17 left. Where's, where's this last guy? Where's Deimos? Die, Deimos. You jackass. Oh, boy. <laughs> We've really uh, been decimated here. Oh, boy. And yes, I understand the appropriate use of the term decimated is to reduce by 10, but um, still. All right. We did it! Okay. Well, uh, I think that's going to be our look at Oklos. Uh As you can see, we move on to Ephesos from here, and, uh, you know, the game just keeps on going. And I love that it has that sort of level of progression to it. Oh, my God, centaurs! Uh, super cool. Uh, but, yeah, uh, I really enjoy it. I'd like to hear what you guys have to say about this game. Um, holy crap, that centaur kicked our ass. Definitely gets harder. 
Um, one last thing, I wanted to look at the menu just to show you guys. There's going to be an encyclopedia here, which I imagine is going to tell you all kinds of stuff about the different characters that are in the game. Uh, and since there are a lot of characters that are actually being brought from Greek history and whatnot like that, it's pretty cool. And it looks like you get uh, level ups as your hero. If you look over on the right hand side, although our hero died several times. So uh, there's a lot of little mechanics like petting skill. What, is, what does that mean? Does that like make your... Uh, your um, animals more strong or something? I don't know. So lots of really cool mechanics going on here. I'm really, uh, I have no idea about a lot of them, but I'm really digging the style, the music, everything about this game is very cool. So I think it's certainly worth keeping your eye on. But uh, that is uh, where we're going to end this episode. Thank you all for watching. If you liked what you saw, please be sure to give the video a like, a favorite, and subscribe to the channel. This has been my look at Oculus. I have been Price, and I will see y'all next time.